Welcome back to my channel. I am so excited for this weekend vlog because it is a spring feeling weekend. The sun is out. It is shining. The birds are chirping. It is warming up just a little bit. And even though we had a small chance of snow tomorrow, that went away on the forecast. So I have lots of high hopes for this weekend. Right now it's Friday. Me and Henry just got back from picking up my car from the mechanic to just get serviced to regular servicing. I am going to finish up work, just respond to a few more emails before it hits 5 p.m. because right now it is about 4.30 on a Friday. And I am going to then change to go to the gym. So my husband and I, we go to CrossFit. We love it. It is a class structure if you're not familiar. And so I go to the 5.30, my husband goes to the 4.30. So right now he is at the gym. And so with baby, we end up just swapping baby. So I head to the gym in my gym clothes with baby in tow. And then I bring him into the gym and we just swap him out. My husband brings him home and then my husband makes dinner bless his soul. He makes a dinner for the family. That's kind of our gym schedule. So I'm going to finish up work so that we can start this weekend off on a strong note. And then I'm going to go ahead and get changed for the gym. Good morning. Good morning, baby. <laughs> you got your little rag? Hmm? You got your little rag? You're sitting in the kitchen while mom makes coffee. Oh. What a sweetie. <laughs> Like your big boy onesies? Hmm? Like your big boy onesies? <gasps> he loves them. He loves them. <laughs> Kevin, sit. Lay down. Okay. <gasps> Good boy. Good boy, Cuffies. <laughs> <laughs> Good morning and happy Saturday. Please excuse the general state of the bedroom right now. It is about 10 a.m. We were able to sleep in until 8 with even with Henry so thank goodness that he slept a little bit longer this morning and we just made coffee, ate breakfast, and we are getting ready for a little family photo shoot this morning. I am so excited for it. So the person who did our maternity photos She's a local photographer in our area, and so she did our maternity photo. She is so, so sweet. And she opened up a photo studio in Minden, which is real close to Carson, about 20 minutes south. And so she's having kind of a day where she invited some previous clients over for a little pre-Easter photo shoot. So it is real quick family photos. I think it's like 15 minutes for 20 or 30 photos, something like that. And they're having live bunnies there. So it's gonna be so cute. It's gonna be our first photos as a family, as a family of three now. So we are so excited. I just put Henry down for a nap because I want him to be super happy for the photo shoot. And so I haven't really perfectly coordinated our outfits for this. I know I probably should have thought about it beforehand, but I haven't. But this right here is an Amazon package that I just got in. 
and I, so it is a skirt that I ordered. So I'm actually going to see, I think it's a little bit spring looking. Um, so I'm going to see if this is going to work for the photo shoot and Henry has tons of outfits to choose from. So I have a really cute outfit picked out for him that is very Eastery. So we're just going to try to coordinate with Henry's style and see if we can make it work. So let me open up the skirt and see if it fits. Okay, I just realized that there's more in this box than just the skirt. So this is the skirt that I ordered. It is kind of a, I feel like Nancy Drew type style. So we're gonna see if we can style that cute with a blouse. I will work on that. But I have some other things. I guess we'll do a little, you know, impromptu Amazon unboxing. So let's see what else we ordered here. Okay, so first we have a book by Taylor Jenkins Reid. I, like many people, I am sure, saw that there is a TV series out for it. So I figured I had to read the book before watching the series. So I went ahead and ordered the book. I have only read The Seven Husbands of Evelyn Hugo by her before. So I'm excited to read another one of her reads. This right here is the desk drawer organizers that I was talking about. Now, I don't know if this is, this might be thin enough for that drawer, but we'll see if that works within that drawer in our office. Hopefully it does. These are some bigger bottles for Henry. So they're by Evenflow. I really, really like that brand. He really likes the bottles and he has had four ounce bottles before. So I'm thinking I, I needed to get some six to eight ounce bottles. So these are eight ounce. And so these are a little upgrade for him when he's a little bit bigger. I think they're a little large for him. So we might have to wait two months for those. And oh, that's it. Okay. I was hoping that my second book would be in there, but I guess I'll have to wait a little bit longer for that one. It was a good photo shoot, although the stress was very real trying to get out the door in time, but it ended up being so sweet and cute. The bunnies were adorable and so well behaved. They are so used to people. So they would just like plop the little bunnies on our laps and they were so cute. They would just sit there and Henry was so fascinated by them. He would try to grab at them, but we definitely made sure that he didn't and was very gentle and it was so cute. But it was one of those things, you know, when you just have, you know, confident photo days and not confident photo days. It was one of those where I was like, I feel like these are not going to turn out just specifically of me. I think Henry's look adorable, but it was just like one thing after another where I couldn't get the outfit to coordinate very well. And then I realized like, oh gosh, my nails are hideous. I didn't even want to show you what they look like right now, but they're very grown out. <laughs> like very grown out. <laughs> I have an appointment set for next week, but my place isn't just like walk-in. You have to set an appointment. And so that was one hand. This is my other hand where half of them are already gone. They're so terrible. And so there was a few where we were holding Henry where I knew that my hands were in the shot. So wasn't a fan of that. And then also at the very end, I noticed that I had lipstick on my teeth. It wasn't like a ton, but it was like a little bit on this tooth for the entire thing. So I'm like, I am just praying that she photo chops, photoshops, that she photoshops my teeth <laughs> and takes that lipstick off. So it's just one thing after another where I'm like, oh my goodness, I know that we got really cute photos of Henry, but did we get a cute family photo? I'm really, really hoping so. But the studio was adorable. Savannah was so sweet. So we finished that. Then we came back home, we had lunch, and then I finished putting the finishing touches on the YouTube video that's going to go out tomorrow morning. So I finished that and I scheduled that. My husband and baby boy have been napping for the last like hour and a half. I think I hear them both waking up now, which is, you know, a downside to 
doing YouTube in addition to a full-time job when you have a baby is you have to skip out on some nap time. So that's a bit of a bummer, but that's okay. I'm not feeling too, too tired. And um, we're going to leave in about 30 minutes to head up to Reno so that we can meet my husband's cousin and his wife. They're doing a road trip. And so they're from Oregon, but they're road tripping down through Nevada to Utah, I believe. I think they're seeing some national parks in Utah. We're going to leave for dinner very, very soon. And I am just really hoping that those photos turn out. <laughs> Say hello. Oh, a sweet boy. Mm. Well, good morning. It is now Sunday. We had a great dinner with my husband's cousin last night. We went to... BJ's up in Reno, they are doing a big vacation where they're seeing seven national parks. So they drove down and so it was really fun to meet them. It was the second time I had met this cousin, but it was the first time I had met his wife. So it was really, really fun. We had a great time at dinner. This little guy did so good in the restaurant, didn't you? So we are, we kind of slept in, it is 9 a.m. And so it is turning out to be a really good weekend so far, really cozy, really a good balance, I feel like. We got some little dusting of snow last night, which was a bit of a bummer, but it's supposed to be really sunny all day, so it's all gonna melt. So we are actually, my husband and I and Henry are going to drive down to my parents' house in Minden, which is 20 minutes south of us, and we're going to have brunch with them this morning. So we're gonna do that kind of later around 11, so we have a couple hours to just hang out at home. So Paul is getting us some coffees from Starbucks, and I am just gonna tidy the house a little bit before we end up going over there. So it'll be nice, it'll be fun. Um, I'm really looking forward to it. finally put up these bookshelves that Henry got for Christmas and I love them. I was afraid that it would make the room feel too claustrophobic because they come out from the wall um, and the room is small anyways, but I think that they look so cute right there. It adds like a little bit more of a, you know, like child's room feel because his room is just very, I don't know, you know, beige baby aesthetic. <laughs> so I think it adds a little bit of color to the room, which I really like. If you look at the card, it shows you where to take it from. But if there was not one here, you could still do that? Yeah. yeah. Hello again. <laughs> Henry is kind of due for his next nap. He's a little bit fussy, so he gets to hang out with me in the little baby carrier, huh? <laughs> our best buddies. So I think that we will end off this video here. If you liked it, please remember to give it just a little thumbs up and we cannot wait to catch you on the next video. Bye friends.